Representative. So how many are there? There's five more, Judge. Seventeen. Okay. Because now the state is claiming that the purpose for those 
highly prejudicial videos is to show that they were sent to a witness. When asked to prove that, the state is demonstrating that it was posted online and somebody responded to it, which is not what the state said, it doesn't show it's being sent to a witness, and it's not for the purpose of establishing its phone, that is his phone, and it contains lyrics that are prejudicial, and we object on four or three grounds. We should say that. Judge, we can always play it without the sound if that's what the defense is concerned on, and still shows that it is his. You're saying, though, the, the messages reflect that there's a threat? It does, Your Honor, and I think that is relevant, and based on the time frame of when it was posted after the homicides, that it is something that should go before the jury. But, Your Honor, if Your Honor is going to make the balancing call on that with regards to if the audio portion is considered too inflammatory, the video portion can be played without any audio. So what do you need the snapshot to count for? So in terms of the information that's already been identified, it's Melly Montana, it's belonging to the defendant. And if you go on down here. This particular message, which is authored by the defendant, sent to Ms. Hamilton, saying that the individual known as Court, also known as Portland, saved in the phone, which is this co-defendant, Portland Henry, says that he saved the life of Mr. Demons, and he's coming everywhere with him because if the crackers come grab him, it's my fault. You What's the date? That is November 9th of 2018. In addition, Your Honor, the, so here's the entire text of it. to um, the statement itself coming in, our position would be that there is no contextual reference of what it refers to. These people have known each other for a long time. Outside of that, um, if that is what they're using as the predicate for needing the Facebook account in evidence and the court deems it to be relevant, the state has offered to, to play it without the prejudicial audio, and we think that would be an acceptable compromise. 
Thank you. <coughs> any other, uh, anything else contained in the Snapchat that has, uh, that you're alleging as threats against uh, witnesses? Because I haven't heard anything no, no, about no. a threat to a witness. No other words. Pardon me? No other of those, no. All right, so regarding the what council is uh, objecting to, the audio portion of those three Snapchats, I agree with you.